Hello Cancer my darlings and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Cancer we're in a, a new little setup here. I hope you like what I did because I think it's absolutely adorable but I have a house full of people right now and I've been traveling to Cancer so um, yeah this is the only place in the house that's quiet right now okay. <laughs> Anyway, Cancer, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and thank you everyone for all of your support, the love, you guys, thank you. Um, thank you to all of my subscribers, everybody new here, I love you. All right, so Cancer, um, and I, I got to be quick about this reading, you guys, because of my company and everything, but um, yeah, there's a person here who's under judgment. Um, and I feel like they could even be suffering some kind of health issue. This is somebody who could be losing or even gaining weight like very quickly, okay? Um, they could be getting some kind of like serious illness from basically from holding in their feelings, okay? It's eating them up inside. It really is. Um, they're carrying this burden around and I feel like it's causing some physical issues, but they're extremely sad. They're very unhappy. They're feeling hopeless about this connection. They're thinking that, I, I feel this person is afraid that you're absolutely over them, that they're going to lose you forever. They could be looking at your old photos and doing a lot of crying. Like I'm feeling a whole lot of crying. All of this water is emotional. Um, emotions overpowering this person. Okay. Um, they're completely overwhelmed. It's really hitting them. Like the, it's sinking in, Cancer, that they're they're never going to be with you again. I feel like this person is, uh, that's at least what they're thinking. They're thinking that this is a hopeless situation, that the soulmate connection is going down, okay? Um, all they're left with are memories of you. They're very sorry. This person's in a whole lot of regret. It says sorry and remorseful right here. Yeah, that this is coming to an end with the Wheel of Fortune. They can feel that they can't come back in. Okay, I feel like this is a big, giant, heavy metal vault door that's slamming shut on this person. Um, I don't even see your energy out here, Cancer. Look, they just don't know what to do. Yeah, look, and you're the one that they want. This person's losing a lot of sleep over you. They're feeling absolutely defeated. Oh, they're in a whole lot of pain, feeling out in the cold. But I feel like that's where this is this is spirit saying this person is learning a lesson. This is the five of pentacles. That's where they thought that you were going to be, right? Um, they wanted you to be out in the cold. I feel like this person wanted you to hurt over them. And all you did was build yourself up, Cancer. Um, not only that, but you were the, the hidden gem. You were. You were the hidden gem. And now they're in a whole lot of regret that they're losing you. Um, you could be very abundant right now. You could be a boss, business owner. You've gone through a major transformation. You're out here looking absolutely beautiful, stunning, stunningly beautiful kind of energy off of you. Um, clarify the higher font. Why is the higher font here for cancer? Yeah, this person's being told to grow up. They've been very immature. They're having to take a look at themselves. I'm feeling hermit energy without the hermit card out here. So, um, yeah, they're, they're looking at the, the ways that they've treated you, Cancer, and now they're feeling the exact same way that they had you feeling, out in the cold. Okay. Yeah. Spirit is making this person look at um, the things that they've done, the, uh, the things they need to change about themselves. They are learning a lesson. When the higher font comes out, it to me, it's like sit down and learn a lesson. Okay, this person was nasty to you in the past. So this is somebody who would say really harsh, nasty things to you in the past um, just to betray you, just, just to hurt your feelings, okay? I feel like all they did was cause chaos and drama, um, constantly fighting, Thought they could say whatever they wanted to say to you. 
okay and get away with it like they acted like they didn't care they were going to say whatever they wanted and that's just that and i feel like this person they they constantly stirred up chaos in your life i don't know and they were very selfish at the same time um i feel like this person was very arrogant um egotistical and now they're they're drained they're it's almost like they feel drained of all their energy they're really afraid that they're never going to get another chance with you the things that they said to you or about you cancer um are it's all coming back on them i feel like they they tried to get um people to believe that you were nothing that you were never going to accomplish anything and now people are seeing through the lies. They may even be coming after this person to fight with them. Yeah, they're seeing all of the things that they said about you were false. Okay, there's a group, there could be a group of people, family, friends, I feel that are um, starting to, to, to defend you now. This They see this person as the devil. They see him as just being toxic. So... Yeah, they're sad, they're feeling hopeless that this is over, and they're sorry for what they've done. But this person was in toxic energy, Cancer. And I feel like they cannot come back in now. Okay, they didn't, they, everybody had the same amount of time to work on themselves. This person didn't. They didn't do anything. I, I feel like all they did was try to um ruin your reputation maybe they were trying to do it to just get your attention i don't know but you kept your attention on all the right stuff and you continue to grow cancer and now look this person's jealous you um you could be very abundant have a lot of money looking good feeling good you're you're healthy here as well uh, some of you could have recently purchased a new home or you've got some wishes coming in because the wheel of fortune is turning in your favor now. Um, now we've started a new cycle. Okay. And spirit has seen all the effort you put into yourself. And now your blessings are going to start rolling in. Cancer, this is blessings coming in. This is the ten of cups and the nine of pentacles. The most pentacles you can have in the deck is ten. This is a completion that's going to, it's like, your life is about to change um, into something that's like it's going to feel like a dream life for you. This is like lifestyles of the rich and famous. The only thing you don't have here is a soulmate at your side. And you're ready for love and that love is coming in as well. So you're getting money. You're, you're getting love. You're getting um, uh, your dreams coming true here. And this person, they just wanted to continue to uh, keep their back turned. This was a game they were playing, Cancer. And they basically, all that they won was a health issue and judgment. And, and losing you, that's, that's it. Here comes new love for you, Cancer. <laughs> the kind of love who's going to want to work on things with you. The kind of love that's going to want to build things with you. I feel like you're about to get an offer from somebody new that's going to lead to a commitment and building generational wealth. Um, ultimate wish fulfillment, right? The kind of life everybody dreams of having. This person over here, too, they may be having a, a bad luck time, right? It feels like bad luck in their life. Things kind of keep happening to this person um, in a negative way, okay? And they're, they're kind of waiting for their ships to come in. This person could be having some financial issues, health issues, issues with their friends and other relationships and connections because nobody believes them anymore. I feel like spirit is out here giving this person their karma, okay? Making them learn a lesson. They're watching you and feeling like an absolute fool, Cancer, because look here, at the end of the cycle, this is what it is. Justice, vindication for you, um, wish fulfillment for you. But for them, they're having a very painful ending, okay, uh, because of all that they've done to you. 
So this person's getting their karma. Your name is being vindicated. You're getting justice and all of these blessings and new love coming in. Okay. Because you did the work. And this person from your past, I don't know. Um, I they've got a lot of toxic energy. So I'm I'm kind of wondering if this person was maybe a karmic masculine. Okay, but you could be dealing with an Aquarius, a Virgo, Capricorn, uh, maybe a Libra. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius there. And you know, a lot of times in your readings, Cancer, this person does come up at the, as the one who's been um, spreading all the gossip about you, being jealous, playing games, ruining um, other connections for you. This is somebody that you clearly have blocked. Yeah, I just heard Taylor Swift, we are never, ever, ever getting back together. Um, yeah, this I feel like uh, you were with this um, King of Wands, possible fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, and they were very toxic, not just to you when you were with them. When you were with them, this was a person who said and did whatever they wanted to do, Cancer. They were nasty to you. They were very cold and mean with their communication. And I feel like a lot of it they did just to hurt you. Okay? They fought with you all the time. I mean, these are confirmations of this person. Um, they're a bit on the wild side. They, um, they, they do impulsive things. Reckless. They're a bit reckless. This person could have some toxic addictions as well. They could be a heavy drinker. They could be a gambler. They could um, do some kind of substance. And spirit knows what they're doing behind the scenes. Spirit sees everything that they're doing, and they know all of their thoughts. And I feel like as, as long as they continue to want to play games with you, um, as long as they continue to be jealous of all of your accomplishments, uh, spirit's not letting them anywhere near you. They're still in devil energy, this one. So, yeah, you're taking that cup. And, Cancer, I feel like you're using your intuition on this person as well, blocking them off of your phone, social media, out of your life. And you're taking this cup of love, and you're going to be offering it to someone new. You know, and I feel like this is a closed door on this past situation, Cancer, but... I will tell you this, any time a door closes, a new one opens, like immediately. Yeah, see, and there's that hermit energy that I felt early on. Yeah, doing nothing but thinking about you, Cancer, as you move forward having this victory. Yes, it's all the truth. And the reason why spirit won't let this person come forward is because they want them in this hermit energy alone and taking a look at how they treated you. This person's a manipulator, Cancer. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Cancer, I feel like new love is coming in for you with this Ace of Cups. You're moving on, having this victory. Like you're, you're in the best position you can possibly be in right now, Cancer. Uh, the position and the and the energy of receiving. Okay, stay in your North Node. Focus on your victory. Focus on your Ten of Cups and your Ten of Pentacles right now because it's coming in. Okay, your uh, love, yep, here comes a new person right now with the Page of Pentacles, Cancer. Here they come. When one door closes, Cancer, another one opens. Okay, and in comes somebody else that you're about to meet that I feel like you're going to move forward with into the Ten of Pentacles, a commitment, building generational wealth. And this person from your past, if you think they're not hurting over this cancer think again if you think this person doesn't ever even think about you oh my gosh cancer this person thinks about you 24 7. they're sad they're crying they're in a whole lot of remorse 
they're sorry for how they treated you. They can see that you were the blessing in love, the holy grail cup of love. But they missed out on that. They turned their nose up at it and they mistreated you. So now this person, it's done with them. I feel like spirits got them looking at themselves right now. They can't come forward, okay? Yeah, and as soon as you meet this new person, they're going to have to let this, they're going to have to let your connection go. You know, and I feel like spirit is telling them this is, in fact, fair, very fair, because cancer did the work and you did not. You don't get to be with cancer anymore. You've mistreated cancer, abused cancer. You don't get to be with cancer anymore. So they're going to have to walk away from this, okay? And you're meeting somebody new. So here comes their replacement. And they're going to be watching you, I feel, cancer, but there's nothing that they can do to stop it. Yeah, look, here comes this. Here comes somebody new for you, cancer. And I feel like this person, you're going to be really happy with this new person. Now, this could be a new friend that's coming in. You're, you're going to get to know them slowly, okay? I feel like this person's going to want to court you the right way. They're going to want to date you, get to know you. This is going to be something I feel like it's going to move fairly slowly. But hey, look, on the bottom of the deck, we've got the four of wands. That's a marriage and commitment card. <laughs> Cancer, you're, you're riding right into it. Six of swords energy, you're moving away from this con old connection here into a new one. And it's going to lead to a commitment. I'm telling you. This is slow movement, though. I feel like you're going to be moving, um, getting to know someone slowly. You're not going to jump into anything. You've been hurt too many times, okay? So just take it slow, Cancer. Get to know this new person. This new person, I feel like it's going um, to lead to a marriage, okay? And something that's long-term, all right? And this person from your past, just know, look, they had a chance to choose a new path. They had a chance to do the right thing and treat you the right way. Spirits had this choice for them to make for a long time, possibly years, right? But they did not choose a new path. They chose the, the toxic devil energy that they've always had with you. So when you get this new person and move away, Cancer, or move on, this person, the, your, your person from your past, they're going to be feeling a whole lot of regret and remorse. This is them on their knees crying, maybe even praying for another chance. I feel like, you know what, Cancer, they're never going to get be able to get over you. They're not. You're always going to be the one that got away. I feel like this person's always going to hurt over this. You know, they're always going to be jealous as they watch you be happy with someone else. This is part of their karma now, is to suffer this for years to come. Okay? Yeah, tower moment. Boom! Because you're about to get an emperor. Cancer, this new person coming in, this one is going to match your energy. Okay, I'm getting the sense that the person you're leaving behind here, this was a karmic individual. I'm getting you haven't even met your real match yet. This person over here, I feel they, they were to teach you some things about yourself, what you weren't going to tolerate anymore. And as soon as you master that, new love comes in. That's absolutely perfect for you. So, yeah, Cancer... Um, you deserve this emperor that's coming forward, okay? But this person from your past, they're going to be suffering a crashing tower moment, probably multiple tower moments. They're, they're getting their karma. They're learning their lessons from what they've done, and they're never going to get over you. Know this. This person is going to be hurting over this for the rest of their days, okay? Ooh, anyway, my darlings, um, 
I've got to go back to the company in my house. Okay, so um, I do hope this helps, Cancer. I hope it resonates. Like and subscribe to the channel, you guys. Let me know what you think of my new little adorable desk area. Okay, I love it. I hope you guys love it too. And um, until next time, Cancer, know that I love you. Take care of you and peace out.